631 is the time now. Experts have long been saying that we're long overdue for a major earthquake along the San Andreas Fault. A new study, though, suggests that this earthquake now has a greater chance of happening within the next year. News Channel 3's Madison Wallace live this morning with some of the details. Madison. Yeah, Jeff, we all remember that 7.1 earthquake that hit Ridgecrest. We felt that here in the valley, and now this new study is suggesting that that quake upped the chances of a large quake along the San Andreas. So the basis of the study, they're saying essentially that that 7.1 quake in Ridgecrest was followed by days of aftershocks. And experts say that series of quakes brought another nearby fault called the Garlock Fault closer to rupture. And if that fault ruptures, then they say there's a high likelihood that a large quake would be triggered on the San Andreas, so it's a bit of a domino effect. The study, which was published in the Bulletin of the Seismological Society of America, predicts a quake with a magnitude 7.5 or greater within the next year along the San Andreas. Now, some seismologists not involved in the study say the conclusions are not confirmed. Lucy jo Jones herself said, quote, it's really interesting science, and I like the way they've been able to increase the complexity of how they do their modeling. That's a real advance, but it's not yet proven. Jones, Jones did say, however, that Californians should be prepared no matter what. It's a great time to make sure you have that emergency earthquake kit on hand. Live from home this morning, Madison Weil, News Channel 3. Yeah, a little planning ahead can make a huge difference when there is a, a major earthquake. Thank you, Madison.